Hello everyone, welcome to week 48. So this week's theme is uh, more the merrier or is it so? So what do you think? You give your uh, opinion about this below in the comments. Uh, you can start typing in the comments so that uh, you will see what is my take on this like whether it's good always that because I experienced this uh, this week that I was overwhelmed with uh, too many uh, responsibilities or opportunities what you want to call them so if you have been following my weekly PhD vlogs I'm Sambit uh, welcome everyone to my channel. I make these videos about studying and living in Netherlands and apart from that I also share my weekly PhD vlogs because now I am uh, almost finishing my second year of my PhD and moving to my third year. Uh, hopefully everything goes well. So the main point that I wanted to make today was uh, that this f past few weeks uh, you might have seen that I was given a lot of uh, opportunities from the uh, Singapore because we are working on a joint project with a group in Singapore. So with reference to my experiments, the way it is going now, uh, one of my supervisor, he suggested that we should uh, build my prototype in such a way uh, that I am building now that we can collaborate with the people from Singapore. So uh, in a way it is good that we have this opportunity but it poses a lot of challenges. So the thing that I wanted to make today is that be it a job or be it a PhD, you will be always faced with these kind of circumstances where you will have a lot of opportunities. So uh, as I mentioned before, uh, I have two promoters or two full professors and one of them also works so the battery in my laptop is low I need to recharge it I'll be back soon so I'm back so what I was saying is that the professor who is in Frankfurt he also offered to uh, use some of his students bachelor students and perform the experiments to get to give you a brief context what I'm working on is like building a tool or a system which can give real-time feedback to people when they are working in groups, small groups of three or four members. So my tool will be able to detect the uh, collaboration between the group members when they are working in group project or meetings uh, from the video and the audio data and give a real-time feedback to support the collaboration. So that's why I am getting all these offers like one from Singapore, one from Frankfurt who is my other professor and also this professor who told about the Singapore thing he also offered to work in some collaborative spaces in TU Delft because now he is the director of Center of Education and Learning which is like a joint program between TU Delft, Leiden and other universities in Netherlands. So you have plenty of opportunities but at some certain point you need to reflect back and reassess yourself whether more is merrier or not. So what I would say is you should not outrightly say no. I mean you should not be overwhelmed or uh, go into that panic situation like uh, what I am going to do, will I be able to manage all this or not. So that's why take your time, think about it and also learn to say no. Like uh, have a discussion, have a frank discussion with a supervisor that is very important. That's why you should choose your supervisor wisely. I've mentioned about this in this video. Why is what is the importance of supervisor during your PhD and then you can easily uh, take advantage of that situation and march ahead. So you like suppose I have this three offers now and for some reason I choose two of them or maybe one of them. It depends on your uh, circumstance. So that's what I wanted to say like you need to every PhD or every position uh, of a person is completely different so you need to reassess your own situation and then take the decision so 
I hope you like this video. If you like this video, then don't forget to share among your friends, smash the thumbs up button and subscribe to the channel and leave your comments below like what type of uh, more videos about PhD or other videos you want to see. And you can also type in your comments like what was your experience, like whether more was merrier or not. So this was just a short advice based on what happened this week. Thank you. Peace.